Tetralogy of Fallot, uh, what is that and how is you as a surgeon get involved can help fix or at least correct some of it? Tetralogy of Fallot is one of the commonest <coughs> types of congenital heart disease and it's the, the classic condition which uh, results in a so-called blue baby. In other words, a baby whose oxygen level is low and therefore has what we call medically cyanosis, but essentially blood that is not as red as it ordinarily would be, and so the patient has a, a relatively blue coloring, particularly in the lips or the tongue or places that are ordinarily quite red. And it's a condition uh, in which there are several components to it, but they result in having an inadequate amount of blood going to the lungs. And the reason for that is there's a large hole in the heart, and that hole uh, abuts into the pulmonary artery, which is the artery that supplies blood to the lungs and generally obstructs it in some way so that the amount of blood getting to the lungs is uh, inadequate and some of the blood that should go to the lungs is going to the body. All of this results in a patient whose blood oxygen level is somewhat low. And how would you approach that surgically to correct it or at least make it more livable? The uh, surgical correction for this condition involves basically closing the hole in the heart so there can't be any mixing of blood at that point and enlarging the pathway from the heart into the lungs. Uh, and that can involve either enlarging the area where the valve is that sits between the heart and lungs, enlarging the right ventricle which pumps blood to the lungs itself, or enlarging the pulmonary artery which is what sits after the valve. Uh, generally patients require some enlargement of all, of, all of these structures.